What's up, people? So we are here right now at the sound check and uh, just rehearsing right now, just getting everything ready to go for tonight because it's about to be super, super, super lit. So that's crazy. Man. I'm here with the most important man of the evening, without, without which this wouldn't have happened. This is uh, Tony Shergil, the owner and the proprietor of uh, Brit Asia and also the Brit Asia Music Awards. How are you? Really good, Sonny. Thank you so much. Now, uh, the awards are still happening, right? So I've just dragged you away from one of the most important nights of the evening. And I'm so glad that I've got two minutes with you. Uh, how important was it for you to carry on recognizing some of the great talent that's been performing and also been recognized tonight? I think, look, Sonny, that, you know, this platform that we provide is that to celebrate and, uh, you know, uh, to, to recognize British Asian um, talent and South Asian community from around the world. And I think there wasn't really a platform really that was recognizing it. And when you give recognition, these people then feel and the artists feel that actually, you know, what, it's worth me doing this mm -hmm. and I'll come and do it again and I'll try harder next year. And I think that's what it's all about, because if we don't keep this music alive, if we don't do collaborations, your next generation will not be interested. It will lose you from the roots. So it's a little bit deeper, you know, even, you know, doing these awards is connecting communities with you. Hi guys, how are you doing tonight? Yeah, we're good, man, we're good. Just catching a vibe. Yeah, how excited are you to be in Wembley tonight? Very excited, man. Excited and celebrating the fact that Brit Asia TV as a, as a channel is here now. You know, we, we've been watching the movements from the early days to see where we are, Wembley SSC Arena, it's a big thing, man. So, very excited. Excited, all, all the homies are here, you know, it's nice to be out to support all these guys, Rax, H, Juggy, Mickey, everyone. So it's, it's, it's a great time, it's like a family moment, so it's good to be here, for sure. I'm very excited. I haven't been to the British Music Awards in a few years, so I'm really excited to see how, how it is now. Yeah, great, do you know what? It's such a great vibe, British Asia, put on a massive platform, uh, it's such a great night. Uh, just looking forward to the rest of the night, you know. I am so excited. I think it's going to be an amazing show. There's so many great acts coming from all over the world, and I have the opportunity to host all these people, so I'm excited. It's, uh, it feels good every, every time I come to British Awards. It feels good. Not only this time, yeah. whenever I come to British Awards, it's a build the feeling. One of the headlining acts tonight here at British Asia Music Awards was Mickey Singh, all the way from uh, the other side of the pond. And it's a pleasure to speak to you, brother. How have you been? It's my pleasure, man. Pleasure is mine. How are you? I'm great. Good. And I'd like to ask you, uh, you know, being an international star and also uh, the music that you produce and the way you do it, um, where's all that inspiration coming from? And also, how did you find your sound? How long did that take? Uh, I mean, it's, it's, it's years in coming, man. Um, it, it's just, uh, for me, it, certain things that inspire me in life is like family, um, where I started, and what kind of music I listened to um, in India. And then I came here, uh, well, I'm not here, yeah. but I, I came to the States when I was 13, and uh, everything that I uh, listened to over there, and then just meeting the right, uh, uh, this is the right kind of people that are also my, uh, also my team members now, yeah. uh, which have their own history uh, yeah. with music. So I think just combining everything together kind of like created something that I was, hoping to do yeah. and just like having them around was was, was kind of like all right this is i can do this the right way now <laughs> Uh, the TV station and also when you see the mainstream media which people say I'm part of with BBC Radio London and WM uh, and we recognize some of these amazing artists that come through uh, how important is it for having these kind of awards and also this kind of representation on those platforms for you as a businessman number one and number two also for the artists who invest their time in you because you sometimes give them the first platform before we even do it 
I think, look, if we give the platform, it, then it goes onto your radar and then you guys realize it's really important, <laughs> which is fantastic. Yeah, yeah. You know, and, and I'm really, really happy and, and, and I see that ripple effect take place. And I think, I think that's great because, look, we've been on air for 11 years now and, yes. you know, it's been, it's been hard. It hasn't been easy, but, you know, we're still champing away. We're still, you know, taking new heights. We've gone global. We've, we've launched on new platforms. You know, uh, we understand how the industry is moving. So we're moving with it. And I think even with artists now, where, you know, where they needed labels now, they could just upload yes. straight onto iTunes and Spotify. And I think, I think it's good that they still understand and recognize how important it is to keep links with media like ourselves. You know what inspired me, uh, you know, is when you worked and it's something that you support all the individuals around you as well. And uh, the medley that you did on YouTube was one of my favorite events of the year. And I've got that on repeat. And it's like a 15 minutes and you give us two versions of it as well. Uh, is it the two versions came out? Is it because you didn't have a favorite or was that the intention in the beginning? For the Urban Disney medley? Yes. Uh, well, um, well, if you want to go to favorites, I have a lot of favorites. That you know, I'm going to go through the favorites. I'm just talking about mine from last year. My daughter's <laughs> listening to that and she's like getting, oh, wow, wow, wow. And she just loves it. You know, I'll tell you a fun fact. Um, we were actually working on another medley recently. And uh, at the end of it, it ended up coming to 30 minutes. So if you do want it. to talk about favorites. Do it. Do it. <laughs> there's a lot of favorites out there. Yeah. But um, uh, the reason... Uh, it was what it was, the Urban Desi Medley, there's, um, well, there's a, a version, I actually started performing okay. one of the versions before we even started making the video and everything. Right. Um, because I was just like, yo, I want to have a part in my set that's, that's kind of like I just collaborate with my audience yeah. and, and, and just kind of like pay homage to the people that came before me. Let's say even if it's on the same stages or whatever it is. So... It started there and, uh, you know, as I, you know, as like uh, uh, started making it a thing and then I started involving more friends into it and yeah. then just more uh, more friends uh, loved the idea that we were doing and then from there it just became Urban Desi Medley. Brilliant. When you come to the British Music Award, you get an award for the award, when you get out of the performance, when you get out of the crowd, you get out of the crowd, you get out of the crowd. पहले आर्टिस्ट आए ने उन्होंने भी यह मंच से आके उन्होंने अवार्ड मिले ने तो थोड़े पीछे हो गए सू देख के कि हाँ मैं इदा का बन आया कि कल इतने आप पहुँच गए कि मैं अवार्ड मिलेगा कि हाँ इतने आप पहुँचना है आह थोड़ा तो इंपोर्टेंट आके इदा द अवार्ड सैरेमनी जा जिस परफोमेंस पता की गल है जी हरेक हरेक बंद आपो अपनी जिंदगी के प्रोरिटीज होंगे ने है ना अज का दिन मैं मैं तो इतने परफॉर्म करना आया है जिम्मे मेरा नॉर्मल खाड़े होंगे जो शो होंगे ने मैं तो वो परफॉर्म करना आया है यानी कि आके जब मैं पता लग गया भी सिद्धू का अवार्ड सिद्धू का अवार्ड वाया भी ठीक है बई है जे मेरे होना थैंक यू सारे लगातार तीन अवार्ड बट ठीक है भी मेरे लिए प्रियोरिटी अवार्ड्स के नो प्यार है ना सम ऑफ योर म्यूजिक इज जस्ट सो आई गैस It's, it's easy on the air if you're a western uh, audience it's not hard for you to get into it but if you're a, you know if you're from a, a diverse background is this nuggets of like this um uh, explosions of uh, memories of when you're with your parents as well and it just takes you to this amazing journey um when you were younger and i guess when you were creating this music do you create like that do you in, do you instinctively know that at some point i am going to throw this burst of uh, this pleasure for the people who are from the diaspora or do you just it comes naturally you know that's interesting that you say that um it, it, it's definitely uh, for me it, it's it's all about s- sticking to my roots okay uh, and whether it's from punjab yeah. or whether my roots that i've developed over in america uh so to me it's it's, it's all about being authentic Right? Like, I don't, I don't want to put something out and it not be authentic or not connect with the people that, were in my, that are in my life. Yeah. You know what I mean? And, like, we all share a story. People that are in my life, we, we all sh- uh, share a, a very similar story. Yeah. So as long as it's all authentic to all of us and it's all authentic to me, I think that's the main thing for me. Because I come from Punjab and then I grew up in America. And um, then I go back to Punjab all the time and I'm back in India. Like I'm connected. So like these are my roots. So like I just to me, it's like I even even when I listen to music, it's 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 I'm, I'm, I'm always keeping an eye on like what's what's hot here, what's hot there, what's popping here. What's, just to make sure like where things are going, 
where I want to take things, yeah. where, like what, what is happening. So for me, I, I think like sticking to the roots is like my main thing. Rola ta ae vi influence kime hunde ne ho. Je unhun awards dinal influence ho ta bohu vadiya gal hai. Baki edda ne creative shows ya edda de creative music award jadi functions hunde hai. Obvious gal hai vi industry no appreciate khas karke inna mulka de vich je koi karo hone ta pa. Hana kind of promoting of culture hi ho jande hana thoda. Oh, 100%. Yeah. Hun jero te si culture ni gal kiti hana. Hun 47. ਪਹਿਲੀ ਵਾਰੀ ਹੁਣ ਇੰਨੀ ਨਹੀਂ ਪਹਿਲੀ ਵਾਰੀ ਨਹੀਂ ਆਪਣਾ ਦੂਜੀ ਵਾਰੀ ਆਪਾਂ ਦੇਖਿਆ ਕਿ ਚਾਰਟਸ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਆ ਕੇ ਉਹ ਐਂਟਰ ਹੋਏ ਨੇ ਠੀਕ ਆ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਐਮਸੀ ਦਾ ਮੁੰਡਿਆ ਤੋਂ ਬਚ ਕੇ ਨਹੀਂ ਉਹ ਪਿੱਛੇ ਬਹੁਤ ਦੇਰ ਪਹਿਲੇ ਉਹ ਆਏ ਸੀ ਆਪਾਂ ਸੋਚਿਆ ਜਦੋਂ ਉਹ ਆਇਆ ਸੀਗਾ ਚਾਰਟ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਆਪਾਂ ਤਾਂ ਬਸ ਹੁਣ ਲਗਾਤਾਰ ਆਪਾਂ ਛਿੱਟੀ ਜਾਣੀਆਂ ਹਿੱਟਸ ਹਨਾ ਆਪਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਇੰਨੀ ਦੇਰ ਵੇਟ ਕਰਨੀ ਪਈ ਕਿ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਆ ਕੇ ਕੀਤੇ ਆ ਹਾਂ ਜਦੋਂ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਹੁਣ ਕਲਚਰ ਦੀ ਗੱਲ ਕੀਤੀ ਆ ਕਿ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਸਟੈਫਨ ਲੋਨ ਨਾਲ ਕੀਤਾ ਸੀਗਾ ਤੇ ਮੈਸਲ ਨਾਲ ਕੀਤਾ ਸੀਗਾ ਇਹ ਇਹ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਪਲੈਨਿੰਗ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਸੀਗਾ ਜਾਂ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੇ ਅਪਰੋਚ ਕੀਤਾ ਸੀ ਆਹ ਕਿੱਦਾਂ ਗਾਣਾ ਬਣਿਆ ਐਕਚੁਅਲੀ ਮੈਂ ਲਾਸਟ ਟਾਈਮ ਨਾ ਇੱਥੇ ਇੱਥੇ ਪਰਫਾਰਮ ਕਰਨ ਆਇਆ ਸੀਗਾ ਫਿਲਮ ਅਵਾਰਡਸ ਤੇ ਹਨਾ ਬ੍ਰਿਟਿਸ਼ ਫਿਲਮ ਅਵਾਰਡਸ ਤੇ ਜੀ ਤੇ ਉਦੋਂ ਮੈਨੂੰ ਮਿਸਟ ਸਟੀਲ ਮਿਲਿਆ ਸੀਗਾ ਬੈਂਗਲਸ ਮਿਲਿਆ ਸੀ ਤੇ ਅਸੀਂ ਬਹਿ ਕੇ ਗੱਲਬਾਤ ਕੀਤੀ ਉਹਨੇ ਮੈਨੂੰ ਦਿਖਾਇਆ ਵੀ ਬ੍ਰੋ ਮੈਂ ਆ 뮤직 ਕਰ ਰਿਹਾ ਕਿਉਂਕਿ ਮੇਰਾ ਵੀ ਬਹੁਤ ਚਕਾ ਹਿਪ ਹੌਪ ਵਾਲਾ ਹਨ ਈਵਨ ਮੈਂ ਵੀ ਕਈ ਅਮਰੀਕਨ ਜਿਹੜੇ ਯਾਨੀ ਕਿ ਮੇਨ ਸਟ੍ਰੀਮ ਆਰਟਿਸਟ ਨੇ ਹਿਪ ਹੌਪ ਦੇ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨਾਲ ਕੰਮ ਕਰ ਚੁੱਕੇ ਹਨ ਤੇ ਮੇਰੇ ਉਹ ਗਾਣੇ ਇਹ ਜਿਹੇ ਆਉਣੇ ਨੇ ਤੇ ਜਦੋਂ ਮੈਨੂੰ ਇੱਧਰ ਮੈਂ ਵੀ ਯੂਕੇ ਵੀ ਬਹੁਤ ਵਧੀਆ ਗੱਲ ਹੈ ਨਾ ਵੀ ਇੱਧਰ ਇੱਧਰਲੇ ਸੀਨ ਜਾ ਕੇ ਦੇਖ ਲੈਣਾ ਵੀ ਕੀ ਆ ਤੇ ਮੈਨੂੰ ਦਿਖਾਇਆ ਵੀ ਹਨਾ ਵੀ ਮੇਰੇ ਮਿਸਟ ਨਾਲ ਗਾਣੇ ਆ ਮੈਨੂੰ ਆਲਰੇਡੀ ਮਿਸ ਦਾ 뮤직 ਬਹੁਤ ਵਧੀਆ ਲੱਗਦਾ ਸੀ ਹਾਂ ਪਹਿਲਾਂ ਹੀ ਸੁਣਦਾ ਸੀ ਪਹਿਲਾਂ ਹੀ ਸੁਣਦਾ ਸੀ ਹਾਂ ਤੇ ਜਦੋਂ ਮਿਸ ਨੂੰ ਮਿਲਿਆ ਮਿਸਟ ਬੋਕ ਐਂਡ ਬੰਦਾ ਨਿਕਲਿਆ ਤੇ ਸਟੈਫ ਵਾਲਾ ਮੇਰੇ ਲਈ ਸਰਪ੍ਰਾਈਜ਼ ਸੀਗਾ ਮੈਨੂੰ ਇਹਨੂੰ ਦੱਸਿਆ ਨਹੀਂ ਸੀਗਾ ਹਾਂ ਤੇ ਉਹ ਮੈਨੂੰ ਕੁਝ ਕੁ ਦਿਨ ਪਹਿਲਾਂ ਹੀ ਪਤਾ ਲੱਗਿਆ ਵੀ ਸਟੈਫ ਵੀ ਗਾਣੇ ਤੇ ਹੈਗੀ ਆ ਸੋ ਸਾਰਾ ਕੁਝ ਐਡਾ ਵਧੀਆ ਹੋਇਆ ਤੇ ਗਾਣਾ ਉੱਤੇ ਦੇ ਤੇ ਦੇਖ ਹੀ ਰਿਹਾ ਯੂਕੇ ਚ ਸਮ ਆਫ ਦੀ ਐਕਟਸ ਥੈਟ ਯੂ ਗੋਟ ਔਨ ਹੇ ਇੰਟਰਨੈਸ਼ਨਲ ਐਕਟਸ ਲਾਈਕ ਯੂ ਗੋਟ ਮਿਕੀ ਸਿੰਘ ਔਨ ਸਟੇਜ ਰਾਈਟ ਨਾਓ ਐਸ ਵੀ ਆਰ ਸਪੀਕਿੰਗ ਯੂਵ ਗੋਟ ਸਿੱਧੂ ਮੂਸੇਵਾਲਾ ਹੀ ਇਜ਼ ਇਨ ਦੀ ਅਦਰ ਰੂਮ ਰਾਈਟ ਨਾਓ ਹੀ ਜਸਟ ਫਿਨਿਸ਼ਡ ਪਰਫਾਰਮਿੰਗ ਐਂਡ ਵਨ ਸਮ ਅਵਾਰਡਸ ਐਸ ਵੈਲ ਟੂ ਗੈਟ ਥੀਸ ਇੰਡੀਵਿਜੂਅਲ ਆਰਟਿਸਟ ਵਾਸ ਇਟ ਕੁਆਇਟ ਹਾਰਡ ਔਰ ਵਾਸ ਇਟ ਦਿ ਲੋਜਿਸਟਿਕਸ ਆਫ ਗੈਟਿੰਗ ਥੈਮ ਹੇਅਰ ਔਨ ਥੈਟ ਵਨ ਨਾਈਟ ਵਿਦ ਥੇਅਰ ਸਕੇਡਿਊਲਸ ਕਾਜ਼ ਥੀਸ ਆਰ ਬਿਜ਼ੀ ਪੀਪਲ logistically very hard yeah. we have to make it work these guys on tour these yeah. guys on demand you know and look we've had some amazing acts here mickey's come on with arjun he's brought a few other you know uh, he's brought um rafdad with him and he's brought other other yeah, mua was here yes. selena sharma performed S- siddu performed with steph london and missed you know these are these are going to be memories that are going to be there for a long time and people remember you know the british asian musical 2019 it was a great lineup and great performance what's going on people it's obviously bad man lots of productions yeah, big respect to the original don raja patchy and dilip what's happening people where's your boy greg simple i'm here at the british asian awards 2019 it's going to be a vibe man british asian people say live and direct wembley for the british asian music awards 2019 excited it's going to be Asian Music Awards 2019 I'm telling you, it's the 